Chapter 10 And it came to pass on the twentieth day of the second month, in the second year, that the cloud was taken up from off the tabernacle of the testimony. And the children of Israel took their journeys out of the wilderness of Sinai, and the cloud rested in the wilderness of Paran. And they first took their journey according to the commandment of the Lord by the hand of Moses. In the first place went the standard of the camp of the children of Judah, according to their armies, and over his host was Nashon the son of Amminadab. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Issachar was Nethaneel the son of Zuar. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Zebulun was Eliab the son of Helon. And the tabernacle was taken down, and the sons of Gershon, and the sons of Merari set forward, bearing the tabernacle. And the standard of the camp of Reuben set forward according to their armies, and over their host was Elizur the son of Shediur. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Simeon was Shalumiel the son of Zurai Shaddai. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Gad was Eliasaph the son of Duel. And the Kohathites set forward bearing the sanctuary, and the other did set up the tabernacle against they came. And the standard of the camp of the children of Ephraim set forward according to their armies, and over his host was Elishama the son of Amihud. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Manasseh was Gamaliel the son of Padazur. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Benjamin was Abidan the son of Gidaonai. And the standard of the camp of the children of Dan set forward, which was the rearward of all the camps throughout their host. And over his host was Ahiezer the son of Amishaddai. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Asher was Pagiel the son of Akran. And over the host of the tribe of the children of Naphtali was Ahira the son of Enan. Thus were the journeyings of the children of Israel according to their armies, when they set forward. And Moses said unto Hobab the son of Raguel the Midianite, Moses' father-in-law, We are journeying unto the place of which the Lord said, I will give it you. Come thou with us, and we will do thee good. For the Lord hath spoken good concerning Israel. And he said unto him, I will not go, but I will depart to mine own land, and to my kindred. And he said, Leave us not, I pray thee, for as much as thou knowest how we are to encamp in the wilderness, and thou mayest be to us instead of eyes. And it shall be, if thou go with us, yea, it shall be, that what goodness the Lord shall do unto us, the same will we do unto thee. And they departed from the mount of the Lord three days' journey, and the ark of the covenant of the Lord went before them in the three days' journey, to search out a resting place for them. And the cloud of the Lord was upon them by day when they went out of the camp. And it came to pass when the ark set forward that Moses said, Rise up, Lord, and let thine enemies be scattered, and let them that hate thee flee before thee. And when it rested, he said, Return, O Lord, unto the many thousands of Israel.